Hello guys, today I'm going to review yet another manga by Mr. Junji Ito. I'm reviewing Lovesickness, which, um, it's a more, it's one of those more recent collections. Um, pretty sure some of these stories are a lot older though. So, um, yeah, it's just, yeah, it's another horror manga by Mr. Ito. And, uh, yeah, let's get into it. So, the main story is, um, a story about a a guy who moves back to his old hometown, and suddenly, um, there's this uh, whole thing where people will go to the centers and corners of, um, in this town and try and meet this guy on the cover, because, um, they will get their fortunes told, but they're, they're just so fascinated by the image of this thing. And he obviously tells them to do horrible, horrible stuff, and they're so lovesick that they'll go do terrible, terrible things. And how this one guy has to go stop them. That's basically all I'm gonna say about the story, and that that's really, it's a really good story, actually. Another good one by Mr. Ito. Mr. Ito strikes again. I'm, I'm starting to become a big fan of this author. But this is another fine work. Um, those include some more short stories, like, um, like the, um, the previous books I've read. Like, it includes, um, like the Frankenstein book, I forgot to talk about some of the short stories, so like, but, like, they, they were okay. Like, this has the, uh, the, 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 um, the Kikazuri siblings duology, which was interesting. Mansion of Phantom Pain was a neat, uh, neat idea. The Rip Woman was excellent, and then Memories of Real Poop was another comedy, just like the finale of the Frankenstein collection. But, um, yeah, this was just another fine book, uh, and I don't really have too, too much else to say, aside, it's like, again, if you like stuff like that's very, like, Clyde Barker and Lovecraftian, then, yeah, ch definitely check this out. You'll probably really dig this. It's, um... It's one of my more favorite Edo books of the ones I've read, and yeah, I dig it. It's a good read, and uh, Joey approves.